Hello, Casey here uh, with a, a little new tip for the day. Um, one is uh, building out uh, panels, whether with plastic or uh, with even wood or metal. Um, one really great tool that I found is a uh, essentially a reaming or a countersink tool. Um, really fantastic. This is the tool right here. It's got a great little, uh, really sharp curved blade. And this curved blade is really made for uh, countersinking uh, holes. Um, it rattles because there's actually ex extra blades inside the end of this cap, this black plastic cap here. Um, so it's really nice. Um, these blades are extremely sharp. Working with the uh, HDPE plastic that I'm using for my paneling, uh, it I have not gone through a blade in an extremely long time. Uh, really fantastic. These are also not just great for countersinking. I do have countersinking bits, uh, such as this one right here that I do use with my drill press. Uh, and I use those to countersink my holes that I use to mount my panels uh, to my framing um, so they're nice and flush. I don't use a countersink tool for that because the countersinking drill bit is much quicker and easier and I can set the precise depth with the drill press. Um, but what I do find this is great for, if you look at holes like this one here, once you drill that big hole through or even with a saw cutting it um, on a straight cut, you can see it gets a little roughed and jagged. So what I do is I take this countersinking tool, reaming tool, and I go ahead and simply just curve that around like so, and all of that debris just came right off. You can see it right here. All that came right off. Now this hole is nice and clean and smooth, and so it makes a really nice spaced interchange. Another great, um, you can also do the same really for um, also going right along these edges here. I'll show you, pull it towards me, go right along the edge. I pull that nice long strip of, of that uh, kind of rough edging off there where it's sticking out a little tattered and it also smooths it out and rounds it off just ever so slightly. So it gives it a nice slight rounded look. On most of my paneling, what I do is actually do a quarter inch rounded uh, profile on most of the edges that are, any of the edges are really exposed would not be up against our panel. But this works really well for that inside edge that may not be exposed or some other edge. We just want a little bit of a clean profile, but maybe you want it flat. I've also found it to be great, uh, really useful for where right here, I have a uh, two and three eighths inch hole that I, I drilled because I have a two and three eighths inch hole saw. I also have a two and a half inch hole saw. Unfortunately, the part that I'm installing in here, a water pressure gauge is right in between the two. So I can drill with a two and a half inch, it'll be just slightly bigger, it has a flange around it, so it'll cover that slightly bigger hole. But being the perfectionist that I am, I prefer instead to take my countersinking tool here and I just simply go around a few times, keeping the panel really nice and straight and flush and just digging this in. And as I do that a few times around, I then go to the other side and do the same thing. And by doing so, what I've done now is I essentially have rounded out this hole so that now my uh, water pressure gauge will fit right in nice and flush and I'll just get that water pressure gauge, I'll try it and I'll, and I'll just keep trying until I get it just so it just fits right in so it's really nice and flush. I don't even necessarily need the drills on the flange to hold it in. Of course I will install those, but that's one way to make a hole that you drill with a hole saw just a little bit bigger um, and also to clean up your edges. So provide some really great, or county seat coals, so provide some really great benefits you can buy these uh, pretty much at uh, you know many places um, um, and online or uh, on retail, and they're very inexpensive, well worth the uh, ten dollars or so for what they cost. Thank you so much. That's Casey signing out, uh, and appreciate you listening.